Hello and welcome back to another f episode of Farming Sim with me, Cosmic Knight. How are you? Happy New Year! I uh, hope you all had a lovely Christmas and I uh, hope you've probably all been like me and very busy. <coughs> uh, I haven't stopped. Uh, someone at work decided to take leave last minute, so I've pretty much only had Christmas Day off. Uh, worked all over New Year. But now everything's starting to settle down, um, get back to making some videos. Um, yeah, so I hope you all had a good time. So, well, the reason I've um, started recording now, late at night, where nothing's grown, is because, over here, if we look on the map, Field 17, um, let's go over there and I'll show you. Also, uh, got a new toy, what do you think of this? I saw it on Dur uh, Dur Tepper's, um Mod Spotlight, and I had to download it. I'm a huge motorbike fan. Uh, I have two of my own, and through the years I've had loads of motorbikes. And so, as soon as I could see I could get a motorbike on this, it was uh, inevitable, really. It's pretty cool. It's just like a Russian uh, Ural motor. It's just <laughs> brilliant. Okay, yeah. So uh, this field. Uh, this morning, actually, when I when I logged on, um, it came up for auction. So if you remember, it's normally about 198,000. Oops, wrong button. And the current bid, which is me, is 132,000. So I'm saving myself, you know, a nice little bit of money there. And it's about half an hour to go. So I just want to stand here, fast forward time. Just so if anyone outbids me. I can, um, you know, quickly get back on it. I'm um, got doing quite quite well for money. I've only done one harvest since last episode, but I have had the mow on. I've been doing some mowing missions. Oh, here we go. Look at that. Have some of that. Look, oh, three fields. Um, probably going to try and get field eleven next. Excellent. Oh, would you please have got this field? That's going to make um, each harvest about 100,000, I think. Uh, with this is quite a big acreage here. Um, so, what I'll probably do, I'm probably just going to pause the episode here, fast full time. So, there isn't really much to do um, until everything grows. I just, I've got canola growing here for the reason um, uh, it's on high demand till. Let's go back for another 17 hours. Hopefully, hopefully, so it's fast full time. We can get this grown um, before the high demand finishes. I love this bike, it's so cool. Um, I'll show you around the rest of the farm. Nothing much has changed. Um, oh, I updated um, titanium uh, to 1.02. 0 0.05 and you can't really see it because it's dark but believe it or not the grass is actually green can you believe it yeah they've changed the texture of the grass slightly so it doesn't look dead now which is quite nice um, nothing's changed much down here uh, the reason this has moved I did try and pick up some straw with it uh, it didn't seem to work but I didn't try that hard I uh, just turned it to chaff so I ended up tipping it in here uh, this is still 85%, uh, no, sorry, 78%, 85% compacting. Oh. Stuck. Oh. Yep, so uh, I'm going to crack on with that, just so cut some of this grass down. Um, going to buy some more cows soon, gosh. Loads and loads and loads I want to do. I love this mod so much, it's so cool. Can even turn the mirror on, look at that. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to pause the episode. Actually, uh, before we do that, I've got 114,000. Um, so I think I'm going to buy some stuff. 
what do we need? Um, I'd quite like a bigger trailer for the overloader to dip into. Um, let me go down there. I'd quite like um, something to pull it. Maybe a front loader. Uh, I don't think I can afford both at the moment. Um, so I've still got bits where I left them from earlier. Uh, I just logged on to do this video, so I haven't. It's a bit, a bit of a mess. So, yeah. So I'd quite like a bigger trailer. Um, let's have a look on the on the farm shop. What mods have we got installed? I've added a couple of mods, nothing too serious. Obviously, the uh, comes with a side cart and a trailer. Um, oops. Uh, yeah, I sold the bail loader and bailer. Um, I wasn't having a lot of luck with that. Um, so we could get this trailer. It is smaller than the in-game one. Don't think we really need that though. See, I, I've almost got enough money to buy the Unimog. 155 horsepower. Um, but then how big is this front loader? So originally I was going to use this front loader. So it's 148. Towing, just yeah, I'm not sure. Not sure. Okay, well, I'm gonna let the uh, let the canola grow, uh, and when we come back, I'll have made my mind up what I want to buy. So, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, and we're back. <coughs> well, funny thing was, um, the great demand for the canola at the flour mill finished at two o'clock, um, but literally at five o'clock, eighteen minutes ago got one for um, a restaurant so that's pretty handy <laughs> so let's uh let's go and get set up and get things going right so let's start the combine off first oh, hopefully that won't be in the way Okay, we've got plenty of fuel, I think. Okay, yeah, it shouldn't run over the bike. Right, so we're carrying on um, with the plan of using course plan and everything. So, northeast, heading west. Don't need to um, turn to start point, but we are going to do one lane before for the headland. I always want to start at first point, which is up here somewhere. Yeah, you can see the uh, grass is, you know, it's got a little bit more colour to it now, can't you? Okay, so. Just going to send him on his way. Hopefully, he should unfold. Yep. Good. And fortunately, being Canoda, it's quite low yield. We've got plenty of time to get the um, uh, overloader set up. I've already uh, set a course up on that field when I done the uh, wheat last episode. Uh, it's set up right the other side and it's still using the original uh, trailer uh, from the first one I set up on camera oh, ok so let's pop this up it's an overloader when we need it oops that's not going to back in there this tractor. 
It's awful for reversing. Okay, that'll do. Let's grab your overloader. Okay, so we can set this. Um, field 16. Overloader. Drive course. Oh, let's... Um, Select that manually and just save any hiccups. We're just getting to do a reset. Uh, the call starts just over this side over here. Yes, yeah, so it's almost halfway around, not even half full yet. Cool. Um, right, this guy. Um, got a bit of leftover wheat on there. We'll tip that. Okay, reset course. Now. What do I want to do? So half of me wants to get a bigger trailer and the other half wants to get a front loader. Do you know what? Should we buy the front loader? I've never played with this one before, so let's just buy it. And we've nearly got enough anyway, we only need 20 grand. So I'm going to leave this trailer here and go and grab That front loader. Okay, let's buy a front weight for it as well. There we go. Just while it's um doing your corn cart. What we do we just pick up these uh these tines first. Somehow they're upside down. <laughs> Oops. Got a nice tractor. Oh, this is the next one up from the model we've already got. Hasn't got um, a fun hitch. Oh well, I should be right. Let's just keep that out of the way and then pick up the tines. It should uh, pull that little trailer, okay. Cool, making hard work of this. as well. We want to set our field speed up to maximum. Let's forget that. Um, turn speed. Yeah, fine. Hopefully maximum. Uh, we want this on the overload empty. Set on grain transport. Okay. So now we've got this. Uh, let's see about getting some sheep so we can get the wall moved. Okay, let's hit drive course and sh should reset itself. 
cool. Where are you going? But yeah, this is where the, the route for this one is. It's just here, goes up there, spins around. Should make a nice little bit of money out of this. Um, what I'm going to do before I seed these fields, because it keeps getting later and later in the day, uh, between each se uh, seeding and harvest, it's going to be dark while we're harvesting. So I'm going to, once these are done, fast forward till 6 a.m. there or thereabouts, and um, then seed all three fields. Yeah, so been pretty busy over the Christmas period. Um like I said only having one day off over Christmas and admittedly I have been off over the weekends but uh got all with family commitments. It's been a bit of a nightmare trying to uh do anything, so I mean, this is the first time I've actually uh, been on the computer for a long while. Missed a bit there. It's okay, I'll get that later. Yeah, I'm so pleased I got this field. I couldn't believe it when the uh, auction came up. And I didn't quite have enough money to uh, get the minimum bid. But fortunately, a couple of uh, mowing jobs come up, and then obviously I had I think it was 24 hours. Yorkshire was running for, so I got a harvesting and uh, sorted, absolutely sorted. Right, well, what I might do actually, I'm going to uh, take over driving this. So, this isn't much else at the moment, it's just a matter of uh, rinse and repeat. Um, I have got a little project in mind, so... Uh, something I've been working on uh, before Christmas. On my, um... I'll call it my test world, it's just a, a, a map I've got where I gave myself loads of money. Uh, and there's a piece of equipment that no one ever uses because it's such a pain in the arse to use uh, that I'm going to make an attempt at using with course play. Well, like I say, make an attempt. I have tried it in my test world and it actually works really well. Um, so I need about a hundred grand for that. And if anyone can guess what it is, they're doing well. Let's diff that out. Yeah, if there's one piece of equipment on the uh, default, uh, you know, the Hagenstead original map that you've never ever used because it's such a pain, you probably guess what it is. But I'm not going to tell you what it is. Uh, that's going to be a surprise. And I'll probably get to it, um, if not next episode, the episode after. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, I'm quite, quite pleased of how it's going to work. Okay, let's put the uh, auger out. I've also uh, re-downloaded the uh, class as well. Um, although these cases are really nice combines, uh, I don't want everything the same. So I thought I'd download that. Uh, just to mix it up a little bit. I haven't installed it yet, uh, but it's in my download box. I do love the scripting for this uh, grain. 
if this is what the next game is going to be like they're making some steps now that it's going to next one I, I don't know what it'd be 2015 farming sim 2015 it's going to be going to be cool it's, it's going to be a good game Yeah, you wait there. Put the order in. Okay. Oh, really? You're pushing me? That's fighting talk where I come from. Until when I started driving, <laughs> most of the bits missing. Yeah, so oh, not really much to do at the moment. Um, might do another harvest off camera just to bring a bit more money in because all I ever seem to do really is uh, show the old combine backs and forwards but that's the trouble playing on hard makes it uh, makes it quite you know it's a bit of a drag sometimes it's quite slow going I must admit, I do like the changes to the grass. Get out. <laughs> Aren't you a Eastern? I know a man that had an old Massey Ferguson combine and he used to, uh, yeah, he had about 100 acres. Uh, he used to get out with it, you know, so he'd be driving the combine, get out, and then find out how much grain's been left behind for no one driving. Just <laughs> some of the things he used to do. I think one time he even uh, crashed into a telegraph pole head on the compound. One thing I just can't quite see the spout. I hate that. I'd love to be able to just see it a bit more.
Okay, and we're back. Sorry about that. Um, in fact, it's crashed on me again. I think it's a little bit rusty. Um, but what we're going to do now, quickly before we uh, wrap up this episode, is just set up the cultivators on these two guys. So this is why I wanted that overloader, so I could get these two running out in tandem, get this field um, cultivated as quick as possible. So I want it on field work, 12 meters. This is double what uh, each one is. Okay, and I want this right, 3 meters, yep, so that's going to be the first one. So, field, 16, northeast, going west. Don't need that, I'm not going to worry with headland. Just sure I haven't tested it yet. Um, okay, so that's ready to go. So this one, same thing, but this time we can just copy the course. We want left three meters. Okay, one thing you want to check as well is the field speed. So, uh, 10 miles an hour is probably about right for cultivating. So, we'll just check this one as well. We want first point 10 miles an hour. If we Send you on your way once he gets a little way down. Just going to sacrifice this little bit of canola. I'd rather get the combine working on the big field over there. Okay, and oh, if you get to click field work, let me get a little way down. And go. Cool. They're working. Okay, so now we've got these two tracks. Um, on the cultivators and eventually I'll upgrade them to be quad tracks with uh, the biggest cultivators uh, probably have another quad track on the cedar and then two or three uh, magnums uh, the case which one is it? I can't remember what it's called now uh, the pumas, sorry uh, on the uh, corn carts Obviously, have a, a couple of lizards on the. Um, you have a load of empty trailer, and taking it to the cell points, and that'll pretty much be uh, be me sorted. But obviously, a long way to go. Yeah. Okay, so this is nearly done. Once we get this set up on the next field, I'll end the episode. Uh, when we come back, um, like I say, I'm probably going to come back and start my next project. Uh, it's probably not going to be what you're expecting, uh, but hopefully, hopefully it might make you use this bit of equipment for hopefully quite a lot of money, so we'll see. Cool, yeah, that's doing enough. Gonna empty this while he's here. Oh. Twenty grams worth of damage. Okay, that's near enough. Right, so next field reset course. Field fifteen. 
northeast, but this time we're heading south. Don't need to return to first location, uh, first point, and we want to do the headland first. Generate that. Uh, first bike point should be over there somewhere. Yeah, you got that about right, have neither uh, spacing. Okay, you need it there. Well, I'd just like to take this uh, opportunity to thank everyone who subscribed to my channel. Um, it keeps going from strength to strength. I think I've got 63, 64 subscribers now. Uh, I'd like to thank each and every one of you. Thank you very much uh, for your support. It does mean a lot to me. And uh, uh, as long as you're all watching, I shall carry on making the videos. And hopefully, you'll learn something. Uh, with regards to cosplay, because I know it can be a little bit daunting for some people, but uh, you know, don't despair. It is a powerful tool, uh, a very powerful tool. Okay, let's just change. You can stay there, actually. It's this one I want to change. Just want field 15. Can't. I need to get more the same name really. It's a bit confusing. Get you near and hit drive now and that should reset it. Cool, okay. Um this will be all long that we're doing for the next hour while this field's uh, been harvested. So I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, take care.